I need you to collect some croc fangs. You may find them in the Flying Dutchman ship. Okay. Which wants you to collect croc fangs in the Flying Dutchman ship? We shall do that. Welcome back to more Knights of Pen and Paper Plus One Edition. Oh man. And this is main quest line, so. Making progress. Alright, now we're gonna get attacked. Oh, no way. It's more dangerous going between the castle and the beach than it is going to the ship. Five croc fangs, so. I don't know which one I get them off of. Shipmaster croc? One captain. Whole bunch of shipmasters. Let's do it. Vanish. Hard skin. Prepare for the onslaught. Wow, that apparently hard skin was definitely a good way to go. Oh, there's a meteor. A lot of damage if you add all those numbers up. Get Grandma back up. Double strike. Want those crits. Gotta have those crits. Three damage critical. Well, I got the critical I wanted. Ouch. Put that holy shield up. Meteor. It looks like we're gonna have to do a circle heal. Can we please do some more? There's a critical. There we go. Almost 100 damage. That's what I wanted to see. Tweak you. Weaken you. Make you weak. Giant croc man. Alright, we need another leader strike. That did some nice damage. That did more than I thought it would. Another beautiful shot. Restore him back to full health. Not wow, didn't even get him to full health. Jeez. You gonna do something, Grandma? Boom! Ouch. My goodness. Yeah, it's resistance is up. Alright. Not magic resistance, though. Clearly. Get Grandma some health. Yeah. Definitely a lot of physical resistance there. Let's make him weak. Make sure he can't do anything. I guess it could be a she. I'm not sure that it totally matters. You know, gonna die anyways. Alright, circle of healing. And another double strike. We've almost got him. See if we can get <laughs> two damage, because that makes a difference. If we can get all the croc fangs in one go, that'd be nice. Only got one of them, huh? Okay. Oh, man. Goodbye. Oh, there's another one. Yep. Deep freeze. Alright. How many croc fangs? Five! Perfect! That's exactly the number we needed. Now that you have them, be careful. Let's camp before we go. Oh! Oh my goodness, we rolled the right number. The plus one to dice rolls definitely helped. Breakfast time! Back to Journey Village. Ah, oh, we're not gonna get attacked. I thought maybe we'd get attacked on our way back, so I wanted to heal up before I left. You never know with this game. <laughs> get those bad rolls out of the way now. Please get them get them out of the way. And again, you went back to this place. You 
brought the frog fangs. Good job. The witch appreciates your actions. Finally, he's level 21. All right, little brother. How about... More poison. Seashells. I need you to collect some seashells. You can find them on Miami Beach. No problem. Because apparently they sound the same. And again, we're on the road. At least we're just trucking right along. No one's holding us up. We're getting good rolls. Plenty strong enough. We need seashells from monster drops. I guess urchins? I have no idea. Why not? Choose your destiny. <laughs> oh, heart skin. Really need heart skin. Oh, goodness. Heal the mage. <laughs> Go for him, please. Not... Not the mage. Leave the mage alone. Nice hit. Oh, goodness. They went for the cleric. Oh, goodness, circle of healing. Oh, I'm glad I have this cleric. I so need this cleric. Getting very painful very fast. Leader strikes not doing its job. Nice, another hundred. Dish that damage. Alright, let's get you weakened. That works, I'll take it. You know, this does seem actually a little bit like D&D &D in the way the classes are balanced. The mage doesn't do a huge amount of damage to any one of them, whereas the rogue is doing massive damage to one of them. Like 100 damage per turn to one target. Doing a lot of damage. You know, much more than the paladin or the warrior. The cleric's doing no damage, but the cleric's keeping everyone alive, which is important. But then the mage is the one that's doing the most damage per turn by far. It does nearly three times the damage of the rogue, just not to one target. It seems very similar to D&D. I guess cleave, why not? It does damage. I think no, it does about the same amount of damage cleave as uh strike does. Working our way down. Oh yeah, one. <laughs> we got two. Ouch. Oops, I bent. I'm used to right click canceling, that was my bad. Oh well. It'll kill number six. Ah, uh, Meteor! Nice! Oh. oh, you're not dead. You're still not dead. There we go. Victory! Five seashells! I can hear symphonies and seashells. Minus 5% resurrection cost. And 18,000 experience for the party. That's nice. Let's go to Sunset Castle first. Oh my goodness, a nat one. But we were okay. I don't have any grindstones, because I need to go to dungeons and I need to go to caves to get them. And I've not done that. I've not grinded at all. Uh, Goblin's Nail. Third of the week, Sapphire Ring, Satchel of Gems. Don't really need a carrot. 
all this stuff that restores like these tiny amounts. It's like, why do I even want that? I need like this stuff. Portable shield, that's actually pretty helpful. I might pick up some portable shields later. Not right now. I don't need goblin nails. Got a lot of those. Unless I do need them and I'm just forgetting why. 2% crafting success. Minus 2% blacksmith cost. Yeah, I don't think I need to get anything else. And the next item isn't until... Realistically... The next item is, uh... The three ring. Level 25. Alright. Because why would I get this level 23, the 108 gems, when I can go two more levels and get even more health plus magic and regeneration? I mean, come on. Although the pointy amulet, I'll probably fill that up for the little brother. Give him, what, three of those, and that'd be 15 initiative, minus 15 threat, plus 30% critical damage. I don't know if the four, I don't think the four ring's gonna be what I'll fit my guys with. Probably polished metals. I don't know, we'll see. Polished metals and pointy amulets and other stuff. We'll get there when we get there. But first... Oh yeah, we can uh, hire other people. Don't need to go to the tavern. We need to go to the inn. No, we're good on rest. We should be good to go. Alright, back to Journey Village. 1600 gold. We're making good progress on that front. Curious if there's anything to buy. Actually. Snacks I could always do. They're fairly cheap. And they would last basically for this episode. Five percent item find. I'm on that ten percent gold per battle, which does add up. Uh, let's see. Is that fifteen magic? Twenty health. Huh. I might do the arcade. Actually, We've got a clock. Twenty percent magic resistance. There you go. 16 minutes. If I do an arcade, a fridge, and then do some table items. Maybe. I'll think about it. I do, I'm rocking Regen 2 HP. Yeah, that's fine. 4% gold. And 1 HP, 1 MP. And 5% mana steal. Nature resist, minus resurrection, plus 1 attack. <laughs> nice. I don't know what that mana steal even does for me. It's probably helping. Do I need nature resist? I don't know. I'll leave it be, but it's good to know they're there. You brought the seashells. Good job. <laughs> Big grin on little brother's face. 32 more gold. Go get some fur. You should like some furs. The, ba <laughs> the pig bears might have some. You may find them in Goblin's hideout. Let's go, everyone. Wait a second, collect fur from the goblins? Aim for the big bears. 
The witch wants you to collect furs in goblins' hideout. Remember, pig bears, not goblins. Oh, come on. This is an easy place. Level 15? We got goblins. We're only 80% done with the place, though, so there's definitely more to be done. Do need to do a dungeon at some point. Those are very helpful. Grindstone. Yes! Got a grindstone. Alright. Look, five fur from Pig Bears. Yeah, this will be easy. Vanish. Hard skin. Attack over here. Come on. And everyone's back up to good health. Bye. Woo, that does a lot of damage to them. Oh, ho, ho. oh that poor big bear. Holy shield. You're gonna be fine. Another circle of healing. Bye, Pig Bear. Yep, he's dead. Alright, let's move on to this guy. Oh, nice damage. Oh! That hurt. But nothing a circle of healing won't remedy. Another one down. Alright, take out number two. End his misery. Well, that's gonna be it. Eh, you don't need to heal anyone. We're fine. Just drop a meteor on him and call it good. You got fur? Six fur! Back to Journey Village. I believe you can farm grindstones by traveling back and forth. Uh, from the cave to the to wherever. I believe you can. Maybe you have to fight. I'm not entirely certain. I'd have to actually farm it in order to tell you for certain. You brought the furs. Good job. It was easy. Which appreciates your actions. Levels. There we go. Uh, yeah, let's make that 46. I was hoping to go to 45, but okay. More mana. Lots of mana. Aunt. 18 HP regen per turn. My goodness, Grandma. You're a beast. One left. One last quest. May I find them in Dead End Swamp. Alright, so we're going to Dead End Swamp to get some ooze. I think that's manageable. Almost 1,800 gold. That's nice. Five ooze on monster drops. Swamp God, Renegade Souls. Well, this will probably be a little bit more difficult than the goblins, but it shouldn't be that bad. We've won this battle before. Although that hurt. Go ahead and heal Grandma. Oh my goodness. Hard skin. <laughs> Go in for the long haul, this is gonna be bloody. Ouch. Crap. And 29 on criticals. Still did a nice bit of damage, but man, not good enough. Get that holy shield up. Alright, weaken the swamp god. More magic. Ugh, that is ugly. 
Okay, circle of healing. They're both good to go. Super effective for 12 damage. Yeah! And a meteor. Oh my goodness. I don't think this will work. No, I needed the criticals. Might have killed him with criticals, but it did not happen. Alright, get you back up. Keep fighting. We'll be able to win this no problem, it's just going to take longer not being able to use the rogue. Keep them up, even though they're not really all that hurt. Weaken the Swamp God. And drop a Meteor! <laughs> there we go, progress. I like that progress. Smite! One damage. There we go, 22. That's more like it. Oh my goodness, my throat hurts again. Oh, four is. Oh, goodness. I apologize. Extra 57 HP and 11 threat. Let's raise that even more. The warrior is getting a lot of threat, too. Alright, let's camp. We need it. It looks like we have to do that battle all over again. Don't have enough ooze. Alright, Swamp God, Renegade Souls, Vanish! Good strike. I'll do Hard Skin next turn. Right now, Grandma doesn't need it, but she will next turn. And the Paladin's on fire. That's fun for him. Oh yeah. Nice hits. Get that hard skin rolling. Oh. Well, oh goodness, we're all weakened. Well, crap. Holy shield. That was good. That was very nice. Good job on the road. Well, if I can't do damage, I may as well give you debuffs. Drop meteors on you. Oh, everyone's weakened. Hey! Whoa, that was a nice hit. Might actually kill the swamp cod first. Getting a lot of criticals. An absurd amount of criticals. Alright, one more meteor and this will be over. Just about done. <laughs> Doing like no damage per turn. Alright, meteor. Oh, you live. Might. That's the fastest way to kill you. Five ooze! Now we have a lot of ooze. Oh, you got a level. 23% critical. Back to Journey Village. Okay, there we go. Oh goodness, 2700. Wow gotten a lot of gold this episode. Alright, let's sell ooze. One, two, fur, three, four ooze. And use that money we just got to sleep rest at the end. It's a 
grindstone to the blacksmith. Once we go up one level, I'll be able to upgrade all the gear. Really need to do that. Oh, I can already upgrade the shields. I should have been doing this. 10 health, 2% resist all. Nice. Meat hammer. Reattack, 2% life steal. Sure. Oh. Try again. Oh, come on. Once more. There we go. Make sure everything is strong. Well done. Yay! Oh. Oh wow, 300. Oh god, such a horrible fail. That 20. Well done. Oh, I can't do that. The metal headpiece, huh? Oh come on, all the failure. There we go. Regen 2 MP. Chainmail. That was nice. Well done. 15 magic. I think you should get some reinforced armor, Grandma. That would be helpful. And a cultist robe. Nice. Oh, I would like to, yes. Blacksmith doesn't work for free. You brought the ooze. Good job. Success. Yeah. Okay. I need to rest to regain all of that. And I think that'll go ahead and be the end of this episode, guys. So as always, thank you for watching. And we'll see you next time when we deliver potions somewhere. So, see you guys then.